Stage three, negotiation. Sounds simple, I promise you. There is millions of dollars left on the table all across the United States during that negotiation, okay? Follow me on this one. All right, let me tell you the tale of two agents. First one, agent um, only does six or seven listings a year, six or seven transactions, okay? That's the, I believe that's actually the average real estate, you know, if you take all the, in Pennsylvania, if you take all the real estate agents and you average them, you know, what the average transaction is, I believe it's six, six or seven. Okay, so let's just say we're talking about an average real estate agent. He's sitting at the table and he's negotiating and he's going back and forth. You know, human beings will be human. He knows that he has to close this deal to get paid. Is he fighting for your best interest? I cannot tell you how many times I have squeaked out or pulled out an extra $1,000, an extra $1,500. That is cold, hard cash. And unfortunately, when I work for you, I'm your pit bull. I'm your fighter. I'm your boxer. I'm your brawler. Everything that I do is geared toward you. I'm going to bite, kick, and scream for every dime I can get. And I'm telling you, most agents will not fight to the point that they feel that the transaction may be in danger. I'm never gonna put a transaction in danger, but you never know unless you ask. Once again, negotiation, it is a huge part. How they present. You know, other agents know when they have a, a new agent that's hungry for a sale. All of those things come into play. There's a lot of showman stuff, showmanship and experience that goes into the negotiation. And I'll, I'll throw one more thing out there and then you decide, I don't wanna decide for you. You have agent A, who's a new agent, um, who makes six transactions a year, who needs every one of them, car payment, insurance, kids, house payment, whatever. And you have another agent over here that says does 40 or 50 transactions a year. Who's gonna push harder for you? Who's gonna push harder? Who's gonna have more clout? All right, think about that. Millions of dollars get left on the table during the negotiation every year. Don't let that be your money. The most important component in a real estate transaction is your relationship with your realtor. So many times I hear, I never liked him. Um, he rushed me. I, I never felt like I was his priority. It's the number one component. You can have everything else, but if you don't trust and believe in your realtor, it's not going to be a pleasurable transaction. So let me tell you briefly about me. I'm former military former police officer, former SWAT team, trained in negotiation, um, interrogation, all of those things. I bring all of those training and all of my experience every day to work for you. I'm a very straight shooter. What you see is what you get. I'll give you the information. I won't sugarcoat it. I don't believe that's what people want. In closing, I believe people want a realtor that does what they say they're gonna do and tells the truth.